Okay, so we're going over Trophilist review for you today, and this time it's Hail HX Mez. Sorry if I don't know how you would pronounce that name, but you know, I'm excited to look at your list because I can already see that you've got 87.04% completion rate. So, as always, I've already uh, categorized it into Platinums only and alphabetical. And straight from the top, we've got Adventure Time Pirates of the Icarindian. I just butchered the name of that just like I did in my own video of this Platinum. But nice, fair play, you got this one, 23.59%, so it's quite a high Platinum, but still, the game's brilliant. Um, short, but brilliant. Uh, second up, Alex the Kid in Miracle World. I'm actually shocked that that's so high of a percentage. Um, I've got this game, I put the disc in, I played it for about 30 minutes, and to put it bluntly, I just couldn't get into it. I skill issue. That's what, let's just let's any time I talk about a, a a game a platinum that I haven't got but I have played. Let's just assume skill issue. Uh, Astro's Playroom, nice. Of course, the recently released DLC is the only thing that's stopping that one from being hundred percent. But you got the platinum, like everybody should have. Then we got Batman: The Enemy Within uh, and the Telltale series. Um, Enemy Within, is that a Telltale as well? I believe it is. Um, it's the only explanation for the high percentages, but still, you've got to do them to get the Platinums, and you have, so fair play. Uh, ben 10, Power Trip, nice. Haven't played it myself, but it's only a 15.34%, so not the hardest. Uh, Bug Snacks, nice. Again, another one that I've got personally, one of, you know, one of the first games that came out for PS5. Um, completed it in a day and three hours. I think it took me about two years. It was a game that I had to go back to. Uh, Bunny Raiders, I'm sorry. Like, fair play, you've got it, but I, I can't stand that game. I'm so happy that I haven't got that Platinum. After playing it and getting 10 of the 11 gold trophies for it, I'm so glad I missed that last gold. Uh, Call of the Sea, nice, relatively high percentage, so I'm guessing, okay, no, 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 hold the phone, hold the phone. After all of these ones up here, <clears throat> I was starting to think, okay, this account hasn't got very many tough ones from what I can tell, crappy ones, um, telltales, not, not crappy, but okay, crappy, bunny raiders, I hate that game. Fair play, you got it though. Um, but yeah, I was thinking, yeah, this 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 account's gonna just be like you know, decent but basic. But then I see, not ignoring Cat Quest by the way, brilliant game. But then I see Crash Bandicoot, Crash Bandicoot Two, Crash Bandicoot Three, and then even Cuphead underneath. What, like, dude? You can do this kind of skilled game. And you've currently got Bunny Raiders. You know what? All is forgiven. The fact that you got Crash Bandicoot 1, 2, and 3. And Cuphead. Nothing else to be said on that. I mean, the, the these four Platinums are Platinums that I will never get. Not unless I find myself with, like, months of no work. My child grows up. And they make the Platinums easier. Because I, I just suck at Crash Bandicoot and Cuphead. I can't do them. But you know what? You've done them. Fair play. And the fa I mean, look at this. Warped in three days. Let's just say four days. Ba Crash Bandicoot 2 in one week. Cuphead, Crash Bandicoot 1. You know, a month. But fair play. Fair effing play. Moving on. We've got DC League of Super Pets. High percentage... Uh, and I know why, because the game's awful, but it's not one I've played myself. I just know it's awful. Deliver Us the Moon, absolute classic of a game. Haven't got the Platinum myself because once, I, once I'd finished the story, I was just kind of bored. I know I could have got the Platinum on my original playthrough, but I like, I like to play games for what they are. You know, games. And then if I enjoy them, I will go back to them. Uh, Dodgeball Academia, nice one that I have been looking at. I've recently got the physical edition, so potentially going to be doing that one soon. Ghost Runner, nice. Uh, are you working on the DLC currently? 
or is just the platinum and that that be that uh gigantosaurus i don't know what that game is um i've heard of it but i've not i don't know what the trophy list consists of but fair play on that one as well goat simulator 3 nice uh gotham knights that's one that i haven't seen very often um i know that the game wasn't very well received but i think the trophy list isn't too bad from what i remember um hello neighbor 2 in, in truth I have no idea about this game other than I, I watched a video recently of, of a, a friend of mine getting the platinum um, so I know that it's a, an easy one of course anything that takes two hours 22 minutes to platinum it's got to be easy but fair play you've still done it human fall flat nice hundred trophies on on that Christ I, I did not know that um, but fair play it's a game that I've been keeping tabs on recently uh, I am dead. Okay, nice. I guess uh, Ice Age Scratch Nutty Adventure. I own this game physically. I have never played it. I don't know what the trophy consists of, but I have heard it's a it's an easy one. Uh, Infamous Second Son, brilliant game, brilliant platinum. One of the first platinums that I ever earned. Um, but fair play again. It takes two. No. How did you get this one? Was it yourself and somebody else? Or did you do this with two controllers like some of the uh, legendary uh, Platinum Hunters do? <clears throat> I actually played this game uh, for, I'm gonna say a couple of hours with my, uh, with my girlfriend and about an hour and 45 minutes of that was just me waiting for her to try and figure out how to jump and run and move and you know, failing to make a jump that she said she was holding right on, but clearly it wasn't because then I did it on her behalf instantly. N not that I'm going to hold that against her much. Uh, Kingdom Hearts 3, nice. That, that's that's a that's a good decent platinum. That's one that I wish I could get. Uh, I just I haven't got the time to go back and and play that game again and go for the actual platinum. Lego 2K Drive. 3.48% yes this is what I'm talking about I'm su I'm really surprised that that's lower than the Crash Bandicoot uh, trophies I'm so shocked at that but I know it's a very grindy one but fair play you have gone for it and you have got it uh, then we've got a whole bunch of Lego games um, so off the top Lego Batman 3 uh, Beyond Gotham nice 15.91% Lego City Undercover, 15.59%. Lego DC Supervillains, 13.33%. Nice. Lego Dimensions, 10.34%. Is my um, my girlfriend's son actually brought this game uh, yesterday at a, a, a car boot, and I said to my girlfriend, I was like, I'm pretty sure that's the game that you can't play anymore but the fact that you did this on the 17th of august last year suggests that i may have been wrong if anyone in the comments can can clarify like what that game is is it the one where you need like the figurines and everything and like other servers still live i'd just like to know um sorry let's back to the video uh lego harry potter one to four Her lego harry potter five to seven jurassic park super marvel at Marvel Super Heroes, Marvel Super Heroes 2, Marvel's Adventures. Of course, how many Legos is there? Um, Ninja Go Movie, Lego Star Wars The Force Awakens, Lego Star Wars The Skywalker Saga. Now, I don't know Lego games. Like, I don't know what... I, I know that most of them consist of, like, getting so many studs, um, so many red bricks, uh, playing with certain characters. But the only one I, I'm going to point out out of the lot, like obviously fair play, well done on getting all of them. But the one I'm going to point out is, oh, there's still more, The Hobbit and The Incredibles. But the Skywalker Saga, I mean, it's 14.02%, so not the most rare. But I know that that one is a long, a long and grindy uh, platinum. So fair play on getting that one. 
Okay, so now we go into Life is Strange. Nice. No, I haven't played them myself. Uh, I've heard that they are easy, but from what I've heard as well, not my type of game. Marvel's Guardian of the Galaxy. I will never say a bad word. Love the game. Absolutely. Bon appetit, chef's kiss. Uh, Marvel Spider-Man 2. Nice. Miles Morales. Nice. Where, where's the original Spider-Man? How can you have Miles Morales and number two, but not the first one? But fair play. Uh, Minecraft, 103 out of 127 trophies. So you got the platinum. You've done a lot of the DLCs. Um, is that, like, was this um, you actually enjoying Minecraft? Or um, a month and five days, it wouldn't have been the, uh, the cheesy way of getting the platinum. But fair play. Minecraft story mode as well. Story Mode Season 2. Is that... Was that... I thought that was DLC, but it actually counts as a full game itself. Nice. Okay. I didn't know that. Monopoly Madness, 10.98%. I'm surprised that a game like that is so low, but fair play. Mate. What, why am I seeing Crash Bandicoot, Cuphead... On the same list as this little pink demon, Peppa Pig. You know what? It's your trophy list. If you enjoyed yourself, that is the main thing. And that that's, that's all anyone can ever say. If you enjoyed yourself, who gives a crap what anyone else thinks? My name is Mayo. One, two, and three. Yeah. Fair play. I'm actually shocked that they are not higher. Actually, no, in, in a sense, I'm actually shocked that these aren't lower because that many people have got these Platinums. Maybe, maybe I'm missing out. Maybe I need to do these just so like I go go up by three. Who knows? We'll see. Uh, Mystic Pillars. I, I have no idea what the game is, which I apologise for. Um, it looks like it was a fairly quick Platinum. Uh, quite a high percentage, so no problem there. Uh, um, no, I actually saw this in the store yesterday. I'd never seen it before, um, but there's a local shop just down the road from from where I live, and it got this uh, fully sealed in um, in a case that like really caught my eye. Uh, but looks like it's uh, a fairly short game. Or other than that, I don't know anything about it. Uh, power wash simulator nice i know that that's uh, a long winded one uh, ratchet and clank <clears throat> ratchet and clank rift apart put my teeth back in 57.05 percent i'm not surprised i mean i'm not bashing the game at all the game is fantastic i can i got the platinum in i think it was one day like i literally turned it on never turned it off but i'm surprised that i'm not surprised but at the same time, I am kind of surprised. Uh, Rocket League, nice. Uh, Rocky, Rocky. Have no idea what the game is, but fair play. Another platinum trophy. Sackboy, a big adventure. I'm seeing that quite often now. Um, is this is that the one that's uh, unobtainable now, or is it the one with the really hard um, challenge where you have to get the one level, the time trial, right at the end? I could be I could be completely chatting pup, but who knows? But still, nice platinum. Uh, Scribble notes. Now that's one you don't see very often at all. And the next one, to be honest, Skylanders Imaginators. I'm guessing that's what I'm thinking it is. Skylanders, the the little figurine things. But fair play on both. Uh, one's just above ten. One's just below ten. Nice and nice. Sonic Frontiers. I've said it in previous videos. I love Sonic. I played it. I got quite far into the game. I just I just ended up getting bored, to put it bluntly. Uh, SpongeBob, Battle for Bikini Bottom, and the Cosmic Shape. What's going on with me today? I can't get my words out properly. Um, but nice for getting both. And then the three Platinums for uh, Spyro. Nice, nice, and nice. Triple nice. Um, Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order, nice. That I know that one's uh, 
I wouldn't say a hard one, but I know it's long-winded. Quite a high percentage. I am not part of that percentage. Uh, Stray. Nice. One that I've got recently. Um, shocked that it isn't a higher percentage. I'm guessing that's just because of that one trophy. The one that I had a lot of trouble with, but persistence pays off. Uh, super liminal. Nice. Uh, I know what the game is. I know what the gameplay is like. I don't know what the trophy list's like, but fair play, you've got this platinum. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Shredder's Revenge. Yes, this is one to be proud of. I, I remember playing this, and my god, it was it was difficult. 8.38%. That is a uh, fair play on that one, M most definitely. Then you got the. Uh, I was about to say the stack, but it's not it's not auto popped. I legitimately played it twice from from the looks of it, but fair play. The Artful Escape, beautiful game. Uh, Tiny King, nice. Uh, was that twenty sixth of January? I'm guessing that was when it first came on to PS Plus. Uh, Toem, haven't played it myself, but I know that it's uh, considered a decent game. Tunic, I've heard that that's amazing. Um, unpacking i played it on my xbox in truth uh, on game pass i think i played it for about 30 minutes and i was just like i can't stand doing this in real life what why why am i doing it in a game uh, i just turned it off I, I couldn't be bothered with it but again fair play you, you've got it untitled goose game nice and then lastly what remains of edith finch very nice so overall a, a, a proper mixed bag um, but as always we'll go through the platinum milestones so your first platinum was Astro's Playroom straight out the gate 10th platinum was Ghost Runner nice 20th platinum was It Takes Two very nice your fastest platinum Shock Horror is My Name Is Mayo your 30th platinum was Lego Star Wars The Skywalker Saga 40th plat, Lego Marvel Superheroes. 50th plat, Lego Dimensions. 75th plat, uh, Rocky, Rocky. And then your latest platinum is Marvel Guardians of the Galaxy. And you haven't got any in your cabinet, but... Oh, okay. Now, now I'm intrigued. Is this what you're playing currently? I don't I know I did it on the last video and it's I'm not going to make it a habit but I want to look at what you're currently playing because okay you're currently playing Ghost Runner 2 oh mate crash cash crash team rumble two one one trophy I know it says two but the second one's the platinum isn't it uh, one trophy From the looks of it, you are working on some bangers. I... You know what? Everything I've said, I'll take it back. From the looks of it, you are actively trying to get some absolute bangers. And it's definitely just a mixed bag. Some absolutely amazing Platinums, some absolutely atrocious ones but as long as you enjoyed yourself when you got them then no one else can say anything so fair play um and thank you everyone if uh, for watching and if you do want to be added to the review list just leave the psn profile down below and you'll be added to the list which i will be uh hoping to speed through uh, a bit quicker in the future so thank you everyone for watching and peace